Hello, this is Sean Zaman's Comedians Questions, and I'm lucky enough to have Jack Tolfer here, all the way from... Leicester. Okay. How's tonight? Great. Did you enjoy yourself? Oh, yeah. Where are we? Um, Aylesbury somewhere? We're in a sports hall, mate. Yeah, and we're, we're going to get chucked out since. I'm going to be quick, right? So, who would you say your comedy influences are? I, I really like Kevin Bridges. He's, uh, he's my favourite comedian out of all of the comedians. Okay. And, and Sean Zaman. Oh, obviously, that's what I was waiting for. And um, what would you say your style is like? I'm really slow and boring and uh, considered and... Not boring. Uh, no, but you know what I mean. Yeah. Like it's really slow, but it's not out of choice. I'm just, it's just I'm better at it than I tried. Like the to be really jovial, like most comedians are. Mm. I'm no good at it, mate. Okay, I'm no good at That's it. it. So you I find your style. I fell into doing it slow. Yeah, and it works for you. It's yeah, it's going all right. Okay. Uh, what is your writing process? Have you got one? Uh, yeah, I had like. I had one joke in during a set because, as I said, I was quite slow. Mm-hmm. I can't do like a whole new five or ten or whatever okay. slowly because people just like fuck off, mate. Okay. So I have to add one joke in after it's been going all right so far, mm-hmm. and it works actually because if if it's going if like if I do a joke one time and it goes badly, I just won't use it. But if it goes well one time, then I try it like in the same place or in a different place. So it, it seems to go all right until after like I've, I've not done anywhere near an hour. Mm. So I don't know how I fair with that. Okay. Uh, next question is, where do you get your inspiration for your ideas from? Where, where does it happen? Um, I really, really like, really like stupid comedy, even though Conrad is my favourite, he's just quite, he, he talks about normal life and things like that and mm-hmm. his take on it. I really like stupid like character comedy, mm-hmm. um, like Angelos Epithemius, oh, yeah, that, yeah. that kind of thing, I okay. like, really love it. Yeah. So if I think of something ridiculous, mm-hmm. I'll put it in my notes on my phone and then try it. And a lot of the time, I do it and everyone's like, no, it's not. Okay. But sometimes you get something nice and then that's when I add it in. Okay. Um, that's the kind of thing I like. And how many times are you willing to try it out before you? Genuinely, I'm a shit ass once. Okay. Like one time. If it, like, if it's one time and it's all right, I'll probably try it again. If it's one time and it doesn't go, bad, it doesn't go well at all, then I, I do kind of. I just keep trying it. You know. That's okay. I just keep, keep you know. The, yeah, I can't. I can't yeah. do it. I just. It's not. I just. It just can't. Dies if it dies, I just think I can't even try and say it again. Okay. Which is bad because I think I think most comedians try things more. Yeah. I think I think they do. I think that they have to be after rave things like that. Yeah. But I'm just not. I just sort of. Okay, that's fine. Okay. Uh, do you get nervous before a gig? Yeah. Okay. Right. Really, really, really nervous. Coping strategies. Twitch. <laughs> Just, just looking to it. I find I'm nervous, but I'll translate that as excitement before the gig, and then it just goes well, as soon as I start performing. Do you yeah, well, well, if, if I go on in the first show goes well, then I'm fine. It's yeah. when I'm on the there's one on the side. I tell people I'm fine. So like, are you nervous now? I'm fine, mate. But I'm not. Okay. And I think I think, I think anyone that says that they're all right aren't because yeah. I think if you if, if you're that arrogant that you're fine on the side of the stage, then you're probably not going to do all right. I really like. I, I don't know. Next one. Where do you want to get to in your performance? Where would you like to go? Um, I lot I really like doing the real slow stuff, and if I could get to like half an hour of holding a room like that, because mm. it gets it, it's hard to begin with, and once you're in, you're in, and it's going well. Yeah. But, it, but to extend it out, mm. um, being slow and like, doing those massive pauses, mm. if I could extend that to a, like a real long set and make it work. What's the longest like, you've got so far? Um. Like twenty five doing that, but it was really? like a, right. yeah, but it was lucky twenty five because the room was really nice. Lucky like, twenty five. Yeah, well, no, it was because like it was going well, mm. but and and just that room at that night really liked it, so it, it it allowed me to extend it out. Whereas if I'd done the same twenty five somewhere else, I could have been like three minutes in. Are you doing Edinburgh months. this year? I think I'm gonna go for a weekend, but not properly. No, I've oh. not been. I've been to Edinburgh on holiday, but I've never been to the festival. I'm gonna go to the festival, and the Veldot's holding the camera kind. You might go as well this year. Uh, okay, that's been Jack Tolfer. Thank you for your. Uh, uh, thanks for listening, mate. Yeah, man, been... that's all right. And uh, I'll upload it. Sorry, I'm, later. sorry, I'm not. Yeah, I'm good. a good interviewee. Uh, you are. That was it. It's been really interesting, only to other comedians. Yeah. Because like you know, Laval's thing. He's only done like four gigs. Yeah. So like when I was asking him about it, he goes, "Oh, why are you asking me?" You know.